was a smiling Dick Davis who was lauded by women from his Portsmouth hometown and throughout Tidewater, paying $100 each to attend the luncheon. Those who couldn't make it sent in donations for a total of nearly $13,000. According to campaign officials, the rather large contribution will go toward obtaining media time and television airplay of this campaign commercial. And we were very, very poor. And uh, I had to do whatever kind of work I could. Accompanied by his wife, Martha, the Democratic Senate candidate talked to the group about several issues, including national defense and his support of the 600-ship Navy. While he didn't mention his Republican opponent, Paul Tribble, or President Reagan's visit to Richmond on Tribble's behalf, we asked Davis about it. The president uh, has that many of his programs that haven't worked have perhaps not been uh, all of his fault, but uh, a number of the people who surrounded him, I think, have perhaps not advised him wisely, and I think that some of those who have supported him in Congress are, are similarly making a mistake, but he's certainly welcome here, and I just hope he doesn't get too many votes or too much money from my opponent. Davis says he has no definite plans to have nationally known Democrats come to Virginia to stump on his behalf. While this isn't the largest fundraiser for the Davis campaign, it is the first time anyone here can remember this many women coming together to raise campaign funds for any one candidate. In Portsmouth, Ava Hurdle, The Daily News.